to getting together with family? Playing uh, one holiday. I would say probably having time with my family and uh, enjoying that. Um, finding what's in my, what do you call him, the centre sock. Depend on the kids a lot. They enjoy the Christmas time. Probably Leilani and Sienna opening their presents. That's going to be fun. Uh, yeah, I like Christmas dinner. <laughs> um, looking forward to having a couple of days off. That would be really awesome. Family <laughs> get together. Looking forward to some nice presents. Christian terms. Someone who means a lot to me that was born at Christmas time. Celebration of Christ's birthday and a time to get together with uh, friends and family. Um, the star on the tree. Jesus Christ and uh, sacrifice and coming to the world. Ditto. Ditto. <laughs> Lots of time for reflection, time to be with family. Christmas is the birth of our wonderful Savior, Jesus Christ. Christmas means great to me because uh, it kept reminding me my Savior, Jesus, died for my sin and uh, uh, that remind me to continue to ask for forgiveness and uh, keep growing in the Lord. Well, that means the greatest gift that man's ever received from God. A great deal. Because like, um, I believe that. Christmas is like God truly, the moment God truly identifies with us by sending us so. And so he knows what it is to be like me. And that's awesome. Christmas to me is um, just the thrill of God connecting with his people. I really love it. To me, it means the birth of our Lord Jesus and celebrating that. And that's a real joy to think about what that means into the future. The fact that he came and made a sacrifice for us. So it's really exciting. But it does mean that God loves us so much that he gave Jesus. I suppose it's just the family holiday Christmas time. Yeah. I think having only one present before we got to go to church. When all my family used to get together and we used to compare presents and the mess that they came up. Uh, we went to uh, the church, the Pentecostal church, and um, there were musics, there were food, there were uh, celebrations, and also there were Christmas trees. As a child, Christmas member, we used to go to door to door in Africa and knock and say Happy Christmas and uh, people used to give us the lorries and uh, all sort of gifts they have for kids, which is a uh, normal every year. So as a kid I was uh, always happy to uh, see Christmas coming because that I got a lot of gifts from many people, unknown people, knocking their houses and uh, they give us gifts. If I can remember it's right. I think you have to go how old I am here, but anyway. <laughs> um, I know probably a car that I received uh, when we were living in a tent in Madstone Park. This one was after the House Commission House. Car toys, car drive in, it was really good. of my brothers and I
used to always get CDs, so we'd spend a lot of time listening to music and playing cricket. Very important part of Christmas Day. Uh, we used to always meet as a family, so uh, all the uh, brothers, uh, uh, Molten brothers and their families all met, all the cousins and uncles and everyone met together as uh, for Christmas celebrations and that, everybody just moved away over the years and uh, that hasn't happened for many, many years. The, um, the day when I got my, my child, I don't know how old I was, how old was I? I was probably six or seven years old. I wanted to my child so much and I didn't think I was going to get one and then he had a Christmas morning and there it was. His name's Johnny, he's still really cute. Yeah. I think he's in some suitcase in the roof somewhere now. Yeah. I think a school Christmas, we have a school Christmas and somebody read a Christmas carol. And my best Christmas will be two years ago. I have been here in Australia for 10 years. After that, my family come and reunion with me in the first Christmas with uh, four people sharing the Christmas together. That was my best Christmas. That's a hard question. Um, probably my first cricket suit, very important. <laughs> One year that we uh, actually uh, uh, gave ourselves a holiday over to Canada as, as part of uh, our Christmas giving to each other. That was pretty special. Yeah. <laughs> I'd have to say is I got the same present as my brother and I gave him that present and he gave me the same one but I didn't like it. I was like, oh. Play, uh, swimming goggles. <laughs> my worst is I got a bottle of bubble bath with gold glitter oh, in it. And that is that has got I was like trying to pick up gold glitter for the next oh, Two weeks. I think probably the worst Christmas that you could have is without your family. Uh, being just the two of you, uh, because Christmas is family. Except for the worst gift I ever got was the foot spa. <laughs> don't buy people foot spas, they don't work, it's just a gimmick. And then you've got all this sloppy water to get rid of. Oh, I'm glad you told me because I was going to get a foot spa for it. In my opinion, <laughs> no, I haven't bought it. So my father bought me a, a pair of shorts, and uh, during Christmas time, the shorts torn under. When I was going to uh, knock doors and say Happy Christmas, the under just got broken. That was my worst Christmas. I have to run home, and I didn't have a. a uh, what they, what they call it. I didn't have a spare shot to put on at that time. The worst gift I once got um, off my lovely auntie is a beautiful lady, but she gave me this pair of sunnies that effectively one side of them would cover my whole face. They were ridiculously big. And uh, whilst I was grateful, I, I never wore them. Okay. I can't say that because my parents possibly will see this. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs>